Then this is a new course, uh, Emerging Technology. I prepare this audio as a revision for freshman students, which means section 1, section 2, section 3, section 4, and the veterinary department. Other sections can also use it uh, as input. It's good if they use it. I think there are uh, at least around 12 sections which are taking these courses. But I am assigned only for section 1, 2, 3, 4 in the veterinary department, which means the section that I am teaching. Uh, please take this audio as input and uh, try to read your handouts also. And let me give you some highlights from uh, handout. Uh, chapter 1 mostly speak about uh, introduction to emerging technology. When we come to on si slide number 2, it says that evolution of technologies. Evolution of technologies uh, and they say what is emerging technology. Emerging technology, when we say emerging technology, this term generally used to describe uh, a new technology, but it may also refer to the continuing development of existing technology. As as whole, it describes the general uh, uh, term uh, new technology, but it may also refer to what continuing development of existing technology. Uh, it can have a slightly different meanings when we use this term uh, emerging technology in different area such as uh, media, uh, business, science or uh, education. When we come to the third slide, it says that uh, technology. Okay, in the next slide uh, we have what is the root word of technology and the evolution. The root word of technology in 16 tens used as discourse or treats on an art or the artist. When we say discourse, it is about a dialogue, and when we say treats, it is about what paper, thesis, uh, and exposition like that. But in 1859, which means 1859, the meaning becomes science of the mechanical and the industrial art. The term technology becomes what? The science of the mechanical and the industrial art. When we come to uh, evolution, Evolution means the process of uh, developing by gradual changes. It's the process of developing what? Gradual changes. Technology evolution is a, a theory of a radical transformation of society through technological development. Okay? A theory of radical transformation of society through technological uh, development. When we come to uh, the fourth slide, uh, it says that uh, list of some currently available emerging technology uh, and it listed here. This list include artificial intelligence, blockchain, augmented reality and the virtual reality, as well as cloud computing, Angular and React, DevOps and the Internet of Things or IoT, as well as intelligent apps or iApps, big data, Robotic process and the robotic process automation or RPA. These are these are lists of some uh, currently available emerging uh, technologies. Okay, introduction to industrial revolution. This is a, a history part of uh, industrial revolution. Uh, uh, industrial revolution was a, a period of major industrialization. Is a time of industrialization and the innovations that took place during the late uh, 1700s to early 1800s, which means from late 1700 to early 1800s, this uh, uh, industrial revolution was, was took place. An industrial revolution at its core occurs when a society shifts from using a tool to make what? Uh, product to use new source of energy from using the tools to what? To our products, uh, sources like uh, energy, such as coal. When we say coal, it, we are speaking about uh, oil and the petroleum like this, to power machine in factories. So uh, when a society shifts uh, from using tools to make products to use new source of energy, such as coal, to power machine in factory, at this time, uh, industrial revolution began to arise. 
the revolution started in England with a series of innovation to make uh, labors. Uh, the American Industrial Revolution commonly referred to the Second Industrial Revolution. Uh, started sometimes between 1820, which means 1822, 1870s. Uh, the impact of changing uh, the way items was manufactured. American, uh, American industrialization or American industrial revolution changed what the way item was manufactured. Okay. In England, we say that when society shifts from using tools to make products to use new sources of energy, such as coal, to power machines in factory. When we say coal, we are speaking about petroleums and like that. And this was happen or started in England, but American industrial revolution is impact is changing the way item was manufactured. At the time the impact is changing, uh, the way item was manufactured uh, had a wide reach uh, in indust industries such as uh, textile manufacturing, uh, mining, glass making, and agriculture all had undergone uh, changes. For example, prior to industrial revolution, textile were primarily made of wool, primarily, okay, and they were hand spun. And textile were primarily made of what? Wool, and they were hand spun, okay. From from first industrial revolution, mechanization through water and steam power was uh, happen, okay. Uh, generally, uh, the following industrial revolution uh, fundamentally changed the transfer of the world around us into modern society. Uh, those uh, industrial revolutions include uh, the steam engine, uh, the age of science and the mass production, as well as uh, the rise of digital technology and uh, smart and autonomous system fueled by data and uh, machine learning. This generally changed and transferred our world into a modern society, okay? Okay. Next slide uh, is speak about what the most important innovation of industrial revolution. Uh, the most important innovations of industrial revolutions are three. Uh, transportation, communication, and the industry. These are the most important innovation of what? Industrial uh, revolution. Uh, under transportation, uh, the steam engine and uh, the diesel engine uh, come. The steam engine is uh, uh, it is an engine that uh, make the train to go by pressure of steam. Okay, by heating the engine, it make the train to go on the railroad. When we say the diesel engine, it is the engine that use uh, petroleum uh, for the airplane. Under communication. What began? The telegraph began, transatlantic cable, the phonograph, and as well as the telephone. Okay? Under industry, we have the cotton gain, the sewing machine, as well as electric light. So, you have to know these three most important innovations of industrial revolution, which means transportation, communication, and the industry are the most important innovation of industrial revolution. When we come to slide number nine, uh, it said that uh, historical background, it speak about the historical background of uh, industrial revolution. Uh, it, industrial revolution began in Great Britain in the late uh, 1770s, which means 1770s, before spreading to the rest of Europe. The first European uh, country to be industrialized after England were Belgium, France, and German states. Uh, the final cause of the Industrial Revolution was the effect created by Agricultural Revolution. The Industrial Revolution uh, began in Britain in the 18th century due in part to an uh, increase in food production which was uh, the key outcome of uh, Agricultural uh, Revolution. Under this uh, we have four types of industries namely uh, primary industry, uh, secondary industry, tertiary industry, and uh, quaternary industry. When we say uh, primary industry, this one involves getting uh, raw materials, okay? Example, mining, farming, and fishing. When we come to second industry, this 
involves what manufacturing example making cars and steel under tertiary we have what it's about providing a service like teaching and nursing under quaternary industry it is this one is based on research and development this one involves research and development industry you can take it an example the four types of industries are uh, the primary industry the secondary industry and the quaternary industry primary industry involves getting raw materials for example mining uh, farming and uh, fishing when we come to uh, secondary industry this one also involves manufacturing okay example making cars and uh, steel is under secondary industry when we come to tertiary or the third one industry it's what about providing a service example teaching and nursing okay when we come to a uh, quaternary industry uh, this one involve research and uh, development uh, industry you can take uh, information technology as example under quaternary industry generally we have four types of industries primary industry secondary industry tertiary and uh, quaternary industry when we say primary industry, it's about, it's about raw material, like mining, farming, and fishing. When we come to secondary industry, this one is uh, about manufacturing, uh, making cars and steels. Uh, the tertiary one, uh, about providing service, which means like teaching and nursing. Uh, quaternary industry involves research and the development industry. This is uh, all about uh, four types of uh, industry. Thank you. Cabrera or University. Cabrera or University. About our campus. Cabrera or University, KDU, found in the eastern part of Ethiopia, in the Somali regional state, Korahe Zone. Mission. Providing quality of education, training, and consultancy services, produce national and international competent graduates in different fields of the study. Vision. Cabradahar University aspires to be the first leading higher education in the country for natural resource management and utilization. Establishment. Cabradahar University was established in 2015 as an autonomous public higher education institution with its own legal personality under the proclamation No. 349-2015. Programs KDU started its teaching learning process with four faculties namely Faculty of Dryland Agriculture, Faculty of Business and Economics, Faculty of Social Science and Humanities. Our Location the university's main campus is located in Kebri Dihar town, the capital of Korahe zone. KDU Library and Documentation Service Directorate KDU Library and Documentation Service Directorate is among the directorates that found under Academic Vice President Office. The directorates provides 24-hour services for students and all KDU staffs using both manual and digital systems. KDU Library Directorate is going to establish audio booking system which will help students to listen their lessons by audio. This service give great advantage for blind students as well as other students. KDU Library and Documentation Service Directorate Director Abdi Qadir Dekeni Osman Edited by Furhan Gursam Write us info at kdu.edu.et Cabradahar University, Cabradahar, Ethiopia. Okay, hi students.